Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today I'm going to be doing a makeup tutorial using, you already know, I know you know, because of my eyes. I am using the new ColourPop and I Love Sari Collaboration Palette in Saucy. And I'm pretty sure that you guys have already seen it go all around because it is so pretty. It is such a really pretty plum purpley color. I literally set my alarm and was probably one of the first few that ordered it. So hopefully you guys like this look and if you do then please give this video a thumbs up. I also wanted to share a couple of things with you guys before we get to the video so hold on and listen. So really quickly, I just wanted to show you guys this cute little mug that I got. Um, it says, Hey Girl Hey on it. It's super cute. If you guys didn't already know where that Hey Girl Hey comes from, that comes from Adalia Rose. If you guys are not familiar with her, I'm pretty sure the majority of you guys are already. If you're not, you must follow her. She is a piece of work. She is so funny and very entertaining and just so full of life. Adalia Rose is a 10-year-old young little full-spirited girl who lives here in Texas. Um, Adalia does have a really rare disease called progeria or progeria. I am not exactly sure how the pronunciation goes, but they have this campaign going on right now where she has her design back here and she designed coffee mugs and I collect coffee mugs so I love them. And in the back it has the Progeria Found Research Foundation and it says Adalia Rose on it right here. I also did order a t-shirt. I'm going to leave the link down on this uh, video. It is super cute and it goes to a really great cause. So if you guys would like to be a part of that, then please take a look at it. Another thing that I wanted to remind you guys that if you didn't see my previous video before this, I am doing a 5k giveaway on my channel once I reach 5,000 subscribers on my YouTube channel, which I believe I'm only like 180 away. I have been putting things to the side for this giveaway and all you got to do is just be subscribed to my channel and if you're subscribed to my channel, I am going to be picking a winner. All you got to do is just be subscribed. So make sure you subscribe to this channel and you might be winning, okay? Okay. You want to see how I create this makeup look? Then please keep on watching. All right, all right. So I'm going to go ahead and grab the Morphe brush set that I purchased. It's my first time trying it out. And it's an eye brush set, and it is set 702. Amazing. Only $25, guys. Definitely must have. Here is the I Love Sadie and ColourPop collection in Saucy. And I love these plum and eggplant colors. To be honest, guys, these colors look so good on green eyes. Sometimes on my eyes, I don't really like it too much. But if you have green eyes, definitely use Plum. So I went ahead and I just used a concealer to prime my eyes and I'm setting it with a translucent powder. Alright, first color that we're going in with is Chic Happens. I'm just going to grab a very fluffy blending brush and I'm going to add that to the crease of my eye, making sure that everything is nicely blended. We are going to use this as a transition color. I went ahead and did a smoky eye. I wasn't too sure where I was going to go with this look, but I decided to go ahead and do a smoky eye. So I am going to apply, I believe it's Razzy or Razzy. Don't know how to pronounce it. I'm going to put that all over my eyelid. I'm going to keep working that onto my eyelid and then just making sure that everything is nicely blended. Then with a flat, more synthetic brush, I'm going to use the color Lit. Lit is a really pretty metallic color. I went ahead and sprayed my brush with the Morphe setting spray and it definitely enhanced the color so much more. I'm going to apply that on the inner part of my eyelid so that it can brighten up my eyes. Next, I'm grabbing my favorite, favorite eyeliner. It is the Liquid Matte Eyeliner by NYX Cosmetics. And I love this liquid liner because it dries super quickly and does not stain your eyelid. So I'm gonna go ahead and just kind of wing my eyeliner and then apply some mascara using my Carbon Black Mascara by L'Oreal and grabbing my Camille Lashes by Huda Beauty. The awesome thing about Camille is that they're only the corners of the lashes so it's not like a full strip it's only the half strip so it's only the outer corner it makes the eyes look a little bit more catty and does not block the inner corner of your eyelid I really wanted to have that nice metallic purple like seeping through the eyelashes so I didn't want to block them by having some really heavy lashes then I'm grabbing a small pencil brush and I'm going to just smoke out the bottom of my eyes and then I'm grabbing heavy glam which is that really pretty metallic 
almost like pinky peachy color and I'm applying that on my inner tear duct area. Then I'm just going to coat my bottom lashes with some mascara and then I'm grabbing my IT Cosmetics waterproof pencil liner. I'm going to just apply that on my waterline. I do want to apologize that if the video is a little bit off focus, I am so sorry. I do this by myself. I do not have a viewfinder. So I noticed that my video did go off focus a little bit towards the end. So I'm so sorry about that. I'm still going to post the video because I really needed to get something out there for you guys. But Hopefully you are okay with this. I'm gonna go ahead and use the Huda Beauty 3D Golden Sands Edition Highlighter Palette, and I'm gonna spray my highlighting brush with the Morphe Setting Spray. It definitely enhances so beautifully. All right, so next I am grabbing the two lip colors that I purchased. One is Mamacita and one is 951 or 951. This is 951. This is a like a satin lip color. It's called the Ultra Satin, so it doesn't go fully matte. It's nice and creamy, really pretty color, really natural. It's like a neutral nude, and I'm a little picky about nudes, but this one was a really pretty color. All right, so this is Mamacita. Mamacita is ultra matte, so this is going to dry completely and not transfer onto any lips if you kiss someone or, or your hands or anything. This is going to be long lasting. Believe it or not, this is my first time trying a liquid lipstick from ColourPop and it is so comfortable really really pretty color I am a little like just not comfortable with dark colors because I just don't feel myself but I really do like this one I definitely can see myself wearing it during the fall or the winter um, so yeah really pretty congratulations Karen you're amazing beautiful beautiful young woman and congrats on this collaboration with ColourPop I hope you guys enjoyed this tutorial if you did don't forget to give it a thumbs up and do not forget to subscribe to my channel I'll see you guys on my next video bye Feel like a chola. Link to her. <laughs> so that's gonna complete. I need to shut my face.